example 2, find the coordinates of the points on the curve y equals to 2x cubed minus 3x squared minus 8x plus 7, where the gradient is 4. We want to find the coordinate, okay, so you have to find x and y. And the gradient is 4, okay, the gradient is your m, or we can also get it from your dy dx, okay, your m is 4. And we also can find your dy dx from your curve. Okay, from your curve, your dy dx is 6x squared minus 6x minus 8. Okay, then we compare these two, okay, of dy dx. So, 6x squared minus 6x minus 8 equals to 4. Uh, you get the quadratic equation. Simplify. Uh, minus 12 equals to 0. All the term can be divided with 6. So, x square minus x minus 2. Uh, then, we factorize. Factorize, you can get your x, x minus 2 times x plus 1. Okay, after you get the value of x, okay, we want to find the value of y. So, that you can get the coordinate. So, when x equals to 2, okay, your y will be equals to, okay, substitute into your, your curve. So, 2 times 2 cube minus 3 times 2 square minus 8 times 2 plus 7. Uh, so, you will get negative 5. Uh, proceed when x equals to negative 1 y equals to 2 times negative 1 cube minus 3 times negative 1 square minus x times negative 1 plus 7. Your y is 10. Uh, so, we can conclude that, okay, the coordinate of the points are 2, negative 5 and negative 1, 10. Example 3, the gradient of the tangent to the curve y equals to ax squared plus b at the point 2, 3 is 8. Find the values of a and b. From the question, the gradient of tangent is 8. Gradient of tangent is also dy dx or your mt. Okay, this value is at point 2, 3. We can also find the gradient of tangent from the curve. Okay, let's find the dy dx from the curve. So, your dy dx is equals to 2a x. Uh, what is the value at point 2, 3? At point 2, 3, dy dx is equals to 2 times a times 2 equals to 4a. Okay, now we compare this two values of dy dx. 4a is equals to 8. a is 2. Now we want to find the value of b. Okay, we can substitute the value of a into the curve at point 2, 3. 3 equals to your a is 2 times 2 square plus b. Simplify the values, so b equals to 3 minus 8. Therefore, your b is equals to negative 5. Example 4, find the equation of the tangent to the curve 2y minus x square plus 4x equals to 0, which is parallel to the line y equals to 4x minus 3. So, to find the equation, we must have gradient and point. So, in this question, both value are not given. So, let's proceed for the gradient. So, in this question, it gives that the tangent is parallel okay, to line y equals to 4x minus 3. So, when the line is parallel, that means the gradient is equal. 
from the line y equals to 4x minus 3, the gradient or the value of m is equals to 4. Okay, so that means we can conclude that your m tangent is equals to 4. So now we want to proceed so that we can find the point before we can find the equation of tangent. Uh, so we want to use the curve to y minus x squared plus 4x equals to 0. Okay, so we want to use this curve to find the dy dx so that we can compare with the value of 4. For this curve, we must use implicit differentiation. So 2 dy dx minus 2x plus 4 equals to 0. Simplify. So 2 dy dx equals to 2x minus 4. Therefore, your dy dx is equals to x minus 2. Uh, now, we want to compare dy dx or your m from the above values. So, x minus 2 is equals to 4. Therefore, your x equals to 6. Uh, now, we want to find the value of y. So, we substitute x equals to 6 into, okay, curve. 2y minus 6 square plus 4 times 6 equals to 0. 2y equals to 12. Therefore, your y equals to 6. From x equals to 6, y equals to 6. That means we can use 0.66, okay, to find the equation of tangent uh, with m tangent equals to 4. To find the equation, okay, we use this formula. So, y minus 6 equals to 4 times x minus 6. Okay, simplify the equation for x minus 24 plus 6. Therefore, your equation of tangent is for x minus 18.